Good morning, YouTube. Hot mic check. Okay, here we go. You ready? Today is Friday, April 19th. I'm JB, and welcome to another edition of What's On Today with Discovery Bay, home of the YouTube Comic Community Channel Guide. This is the show where I'm going to share some of my top picks from the sea of comic content that was released yesterday. Then I'm going to run down the lineup of shows that are either releasing or going live today. So let's get started with a quick recap of yesterday's highlights. There are links to these channels in the description below. These channels have been discovered. First up on the recap, if you're not watching Jim's comics, you're missing out. He is always dropping great knowledge in his videos, and yesterday was no different. Jim released a video titled New Comics for New Comic Book Day, April 17th, and Comic News. Let's take a peek. Hello and welcome everyone. It is Thursday, April 18th, 2019. Yesterday was New Comic Book Day, best day of the week. Had another great day of books come out yesterday. Man, there's so much good stuff coming out. Uh, great time to be collecting, so we'll get into that quickly. I'll talk about that and some other books that tie in and stuff coming down the road, all that kind of stuff. Uh, thank you to all my subscribers. Really appreciate you taking the time to watch my videos, send me comments, tips, ask questions. It's all great. Thank you so much. And one of my subs asked me if I'm um, just, hey, you're not giving away any Avengers spoilers, are you? No, I, just so you're all aware, I won't be giving away any. I don't give away movie spoilers. I'll talk comics all day on here, but I don't talk about movies and what's coming down the road. Other than, you know, potentially what um, comics may tie into movies and be good ones to buy, that kind of stuff. But I'm not going to be giving away any spoilers for the movies, so... I think Jim actually reads every single comic he buys and every description in the preview magazines. He's incredible! To check out the entire video and more great content from Jim's Comics, click the link right here. Okay, next up on the recap, we have a cool video from Area 51 titled, Let's Build the D-Cool 3353-54 Motorcycle. Let's check it out. Hey everybody, welcome back. Welcome back to the uh, shop. Welcome back to the comic build side. Anyways, we are going to get on with another Lego build, and I am going to build this uh, D-Cool King Steer motorbike. Uh, I've been looking at this one for quite a while. kind of looks like a Ducati, so uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, build this guy, because I feel like building Lego. So uh, let's get building this bike and see what's inside. So here we are, guys. Just another update on where we are on the uh, Lego Ducati bike. This it doesn't look like a lot since the last uh, shot I gave you, but this is a lot of work. Uh, yeah, you can see all the gears and everything else that goes on with this. So it looks pretty darn good. We're getting there, slowly but surely. Really good. And I'm going to show you how big this bike actually so is. So there's one of those uh, statues that you buy in the box. Uh, I don't know what are these, they're sixth scale or whatever. So this bike is around sixth scale, I think, something like that. Got our good buddy Wolverine sitting beside him there, and he kind of looks like he's uh, ready to go for a ride on this old biker Rooney here. To check out the entire video and more great content from Area 51, click the link right here. Okay, for the final item on the recap, I'm a sucker for the excitement of a CGC graded unboxing. And if you are too, then head over to Certified Comic Shop Channel. Jason released a video titled Friendly Neighborhood CGC Unboxing, April 2019, Certified Comic Shop. Well, hey everybody, it's Jason from the Certified Comic Shop, and it's time for a Friendly Neighborhood CGC Unboxing. Alright guys, well I am back and it is time to unbox another package of CGC Graded Comics. But we're doing something a little different this time because in this box right here, it's down, oh, it's down here, God, it's, I'm going to tell you a little secret. None of the comics in this box are mine, but I still have the box, but they're not mine. So what's going on here? Well. Just a little background information before we get into the good stuff is I recently rolled out two new services uh, for the certified comic shop and um, one of my pals was nice enough to give it a try for me. So I've got two new things that I'm doing at the certified comic shop besides selling awesome graded comics. I now offer CGC facilitation 
and I also offer a consignment service. To check out the entire video and more great content from Jason at Certified Comic Shop, click the link right here. Okay, now let's get to today's lineup and find out what's on today with Discovery Bay. All of these times are listed in both Pacific Standard Time and Eastern Standard Time, and all of the channel links with timestamps are in the description below. Today, there are 11 shows in the lineup and five are going live. So first up, at 1 a.m. Pacific, 4 a.m. Eastern, Joe Ryan Comics gives us back-to-back -back comic review videos. The first is titled War of the Realms number two, comic review. Damn, Odinson! The second video is titled Avengers No Road Home number 10, comic review. The big finale is here. These both drop two hours apart, and by the time I release this, they should be available. At 9 a.m. Pacific, 12 p.m. Eastern, Billy over at Economics and Comics is releasing a video titled Comic Book Unboxing Possible Error Comic. At 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern, over at Erod 212 channel, the master presser himself, Erod, will be releasing the 15th episode in this terrific series titled Is It Slab Worthy? He's going to break down the numbers for us on this book, and by the end of the short video, we're going to know Is It Slab Worthy? At 12 p.m. Pacific, 3 p.m. Eastern. Whosoever watches this channel, if he or she be worthy, shall acquire the knowledge from High Road Comics. Over at the High Road Comics channel, Arrow is releasing a video titled Funko Friday, previewing the Avengers Endgame line. Next up at 4.45 p.m. Pacific, 7.45 p.m. Eastern, over at Perry Comics, we'll get a premiere video titled New Comic Book Day Picks for 4.24.19. Next up at 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern, we start a run of live shows with this one from Three Men in a Basement, Comics and Collectibles Channel, titled Live, First Statue Unboxing with Biggies of the New York Warriors. Also at 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern, head over to Count Von Strange the Fourth's channel for the 16th installment of Figure Friday. Today's premiere video is titled Figure Friday Star Wars Black Series Mimbin Trooper Unboxing. All of these videos from Count are just plain fun and you don't want to miss this one. Okay, also at 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern, head over to Comic Tom 101 for either a video or a live stream. I'm not sure which way he's going with this one now. I would bet he's gonna go live based on the awesome new setup Tom's sporting over there. So today, look for something titled Hot Top 10 Comic Books on the Rise. And this is where Tom and Sensei Russ go over the CBSI Top 10 list and also break in the middle to share some of the comic community's great hunting finds during the week. Make sure you have your notifications on for this one so you don't miss it. Also at 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern, Kenny Metarog Gino Presents and The Gray Man are going live over at Comic Head 84's channel with the next installment in their live streaming series titled Greater's Notes. Today they're going to review Marvel 1602 issue number one. Woo! All right. At 5.30 p.m. Pacific, 8.30 p.m. Eastern, we get another live show. This time Bueller has his weekly live stream titled Comic Book Content on YouTube, What You Need to Know. Hmm. Hey, Bueller, if you want to know about comic content on YouTube, you should have me on there. Wait a minute. You do. That's right. All right. I'm Bueller's special guest tonight. Come join the both of us live as we talk comic content on YouTube. Look forward to seeing everyone in the chat. Okay, next up at 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern, over at the Comic Jabroni channel, he is releasing a premiere video uh, of a great new series titled What? are the Gates of Gotham, Episode 1, Comic Reviews with Jabroni. So this is the first episode of a weekly series where Edwin reviews a miniseries or story arc that are between three and six issues long. The first episode is focused on Batman, Gates of Gotham from 2011, written by Scott Snyder and drawn by Trevor McCarthy. The last item on the lineup and the last live show that I knew about starts at 7 p.m. Pacific, 10 p.m. Eastern. We have Comic Core Live, 
This is where you get Chad, Cat Ren Figures and Mark, The Great Legend, Midwest Comic Man, and of course, Seawood, who does his very best to keep the show from going off the rails. Tonight's special guest is TiVo from Lords of the Long Box, so come join me in the chat and say hello. Well, that's it for today's show, but I wanted to mention a couple things. First, huge shout out to my latest Patreon supporter, JD Comics. John, I can't tell you how much it means to me that you have chosen to support us on Patreon. Welcome aboard. Second is that I will be going live right here on Sunday to open this miniature stack of boxes that it does include a Bueller box and a mystery mail call. Now, everyone, please visit me on Facebook and Instagram where I'm going to be listing this schedule with any ads and or changes this afternoon. And if you enjoyed the video, give me a like. Now, if you know anyone who might be interested in this information or may want to be included in the show, please share this with them. And also, leave me a comment, because I'm always looking for ways to improve the channel and, uh, and looking for new channels that I should be watching. So, if you're, already a, uh, if you're not already a subscriber, think about subscribing so you don't miss out on any of these cool shows, and I hope somebody finds some new content from today's show. And as always, Hot Mike, don't forget, we had a good time.